All right, guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. So we're going to take a look at the EZA Goten. Uh, so Goten and Trunks both got an EZA. Um, what I'm probably going to do is I'm definitely... I'm, I'm, we're going to use both of them together, right, EZA. But I am going to give them each their own focus video, right? So Goten and Trunks, I mean, they have several 200% teams together. So we have good teams here. Let me actually pull up. All right, so right here, these are Goten's 200% teams, and here's Trunks's 200% teams. I mean, as you guys can see, we have really powerful setups where these characters are able to be used, you know, on a 200% leader skill. So we could test them out on a couple of different teams. Um, the first video will be geared around Goten, but again, we're going to use Trunks in the video as well. And then I, I do want to make sure that every character gets their own video, but of course we're going to use Goten and Trunks together because that's what the intended purpose. The characters are virtually identical just outside of essentially right there categories um that's that's basically like like just just the fact that like goten is on goku family and you know trunks is on vegeta family that type of stuff now in terms of the build here um i view goten and trunks as i mean i don't know i want to say i view them as support units if anything the one thing i don't like about goten and trunks is that their support is not active in slot three um, I feel like I would like this character a little bit better because, like, here's how I would describe this. Like, Goten and Trunks are not going to be able to match up with, like, a super good, I don't know, Kamehameha Dokkan Fest LR leader or something like that. When Kamehameha gets a leader skill, it's going to be Super Vegito, Super Saiyan 4 Goku, Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, UI Goku. It's going to be, like, some crazy popular you know, big hype Dokkan Fast Seller type character who is going to be going in like slot one or two over this Goten and Trunks, right? Like these are sub EZAs. I think Goten and Trunks are good for sub EZAs, really good. But I would prefer if their support was that they could be run in slot three. Now, I I'm kind of thinking them as more of like defense, like support type characters. Although I think that they should be able to do solid damage for I mean, I guess at least in my mind's eye, what I have their role as. So I'm definitely going more towards the dodge aspect of it. Um, they have damage reduction, which should be solid. Now, people will get lulled to sleep by seeing just the 50% damage reduction and think that they're going to be like, oh my god, so tanky. But 50% damage reduction doesn't mean that much nowadays. I know that might seem insane to people, but it's true. Uh, you have to have massive defense in order for that 50% damage reduction to truly stand out. So, we'll see what these characters look like. Um, let's go ahead and jump in. Again, we're, we're going to focus on Goten here in the first video. And then the second video, we'll highlight Trunks. Alright guys, I know that this is the Goten video. But here's how our rotations are kind of like panning out for us. Um, I'm going to do this. And then we'll we'll kind of see how things are going to look, right? Again, the, the major focus I want of the video to be is Goten. Um, so we'll see a rotation where Goten doesn't have Trunks in rotation. Um, and then after that, every turn after this, we're going to have Trunks in rotation. So we're in the Supreme Battle Spectacle UI Goku fight. Um, UI Goku, um, he he can be strong. I I don't know. I, the Evolution Blue Vegeta fight is probably a bit trickier. Just because I think Vegeta is much tougher right away. Okay, so 7 million for Trunks. Okay. Um, that is a little low. I mean, that is without Goten, I guess. All right, so we're going to get Super. This is with the 50% damage reduction. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Are you shitting me, dude? Okay, there's your 50% damage reduction, dude. Holy Christ. What? Okay. God damn, dude. Yeah, I mean, here, like, uh, so here's Trunks. And it's like, that's, guys, that's what 50% damage reduction looks like. Uh, you know, it's like, that's... Holy hell. Um, again, with Goten, like, when they're on rotation together, they'll have 80% damage reduction. But, god damn, 300k right away? That's, well, at the very least, people understand within two seconds of the video exactly what I was talking about. Holy hell. Okay. Um, Alright, so. Damn, that was a bit more damage than I was anticipating there. Okay. Whew. 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 Okay. Okay. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Uh, all this means is Super Vegito will have an easy transformation, right? That's, let's just look at it, like, boom. 
right away, we have easy transformation for Super Vegito. That's the way we could look at this. So he supered in slot three. Um, Goku and Vegeta should be safe. I'm not really too concerned with Goku, Vegeta, and Trunks at the end getting a nice super attack or anything like that. All right, let's hit this. So Goten, just on turn one right here, he's at 170k defense. So Goten... Ah, uh, you know, you know what it is, is, okay, Goten and Trunks, they don't get defense from uh, their passive, like, passives, like, they don't have a multiplicative defensive buff in their passive, right? So, like, Goten is just getting 180% attack and defense at the start of turn, and that's it for defense in the passive, just besides his damage reduction. So, I mean, they are going to get 50% attack and defense from their super attack effect, but that's where the characters are held back from being, like, gods. Like, it, you know, if you would give Goten and Trunks, like, 100% attack and defense when performing a super attack, like, just, just as, like, the next line of their passive, like, they're busted as hell, right? Like, they're super crazy. I think that they're still good. But, again, I, I do think that it's one of those things where Global doesn't have Supreme Battle Spectacle in these big fights yet. So, like, they're like, oh, yeah, dude, 50% damage reduction. Like, we're, we're, dude, we're so good. It's like, well, I mean, I, I like 50% damage reduction for sure, but, you know, it has limitations, unfortunately. Now, so then, okay, then there's the extra 120% attack and 30% damage reduction on super attack if there's another Trunks or Krillin in the turn. Or for uh, Trunks, it's if there's a Goten or Krillin in the same turn. Right, they have the same passive besides that one wording, right? Just, you know, the other character. Uh, and then, I almost feel like I just want to show this on screen the way it looks. So then, depending upon what slot we are, we're going to activate one of these two abilities. Judging from what I'm looking for from these characters, I think they're probably going to be at their best in slot two. Kamehameha category allies two key 70% attack. And then they get a 30% chance to crit as a second attacker. That seems pretty good. Um, then, of course, there's their slot one ability. And then slot three, they don't have um, support, unfortunately. Um, it's just the the big extra attack, high chance to crit as a third attacker on the turn. And three key. Interesting. All right, so they're going to pretty much auto super then. All right, uh, let's just go ahead and get this uh, turn for us real quick. Uh, all right, sure. All right, let's see uh, the damage that Goten is going to do. I would assume Goten's damage is going to be very similar, though, to the damage we saw Trunks do last turn. Um, I guess Trunks did have High School Gohan as a support type unit on that turn, though. Uh, see, I think the Goten and Trunks will be solid. I'm looking for the... Like, they could be very interesting if we would potentially get, like, a Kamehameha team that's led by, you know, a Krillin or another Goten and Trunks or something like that, for sure. Or... When the Dokkan Fest physical Goten and Trunks get their EZA, that, I think, could be very interesting as well. I, I think when that character gets their EZA, 3 million? 3? Wow. Okay. Huh. Yeah, I mean, so, but, but they are supporting. I mean, I guess we should just look at the fact that, you know, Goten's attacks are much lower right there. But, again, the Kamehameha allies two key 70 percent attack um support was up all right let me just come back to the next rotation we'll have goten and trunks together finally you know what um a little risky we do have this gohan at the start right there i mean this gohan of course i mean he's solid you know both of these world tournament gohans are solid but you know we're gonna need dodges or you know good luck with them uh goku vegeta and trunks will probably do a huge amount of damage right here i think we could kill this blue goku Again, this is the difference between Supreme Battle Spectacle, uh, Evolution Blue Vegeta, and the UI Goku, is that the Evolution Blue Vegeta is just two phases that both do reasonable damage, and obviously Evolution Blue Vegeta Super Attack is devastating. Whereas the UI Goku fight, the God Goku and Blue Goku stages are a warm-up. And then once he goes into UI... Oh, we just got 50 normals. Yeah, oh my god, what a shock. Never seen that before. Okay, good. I, I got word that was going to be a Super Attack right there. Uh, high School Gohan should be fine, right? Let's hope. Let's hope. Let's hope. Okay, there's super attack at slot three. Couple of slot three super attacks. Yep, thank you. Whew, okay. Couple of slot three super attacks so far in this video. Not really a fan of that. God damn it, dude. Huh. Oh, damn. Yeah, um. 
Uh, this is the thing, like, they can't really function as a rotation, really. It's not, like, it's not gonna work. Because, look at this. So, we have 50% damage reduction with 170k defense. It just doesn't cut it. Like, that's not, that does not cut it. It's not even close. So, it, it's like these, like, Goten and Trunks, the only way they're gonna really be able to live at their best, right? Which is, again, with each other on rotation... They get the extra 120% attack and extra 30% damage reduction, but it's when they're performing a super. So, like, Goten is going to have 80% damage reduction right here after he super attacks. So. Uh, the other thing, too. Man, I don't know. I'm going to let it go like this, but we know Goku's not going to super attack. All right, let's see how we do. I I should try and prioritize getting Vegito transformed. I gotta stop getting same type orbs, but we'll take damage here. Okay, good dodge. Well, yeah, build your characters the right way, and I guess you could run them as a rotation, right? Just know how to build your characters, guys, and you're good. All right, nine million right there. Eh, not the craziest, but he does have eighty percent damage reduction after that. Then Trunks is at thirteen right there, because I mean he's in. Um, okay, and then. He gets an additional super, and he's up to 15 million. I should reverse this and make this the trunk sh showcase, actually. Then we'll swap the next one to the Goten one. Uh, oh, I, I should talk about their super attack effect, which is um, pretty decent. I mean, that's what we saw Trunks' damage steadily go up, right? So, um, both of their super attacks are the same. Oh, we'll definitely We can just kill you, Goku, right here. Yeah, we might as well. All right, so both Goten and Trunks have the same super attack effect. They get 50% attack and defense for one turn, and then they give allies 40% attack for one turn as well from their super attack effect. Really, if we think about it, anything we see Trunks do is, you know, pretty much the same thing as Goten, because even their Link set is literally exactly the same, right? Their Link set is Golden Warrior, Super Saiyan, Kamehameha, Budding Warrior, the Innocents Prepare for Battle and Fierce Battle. Budding Warrior is just the characters you would expect. Goten Trunks. Doesn't, isn't there a Gotenks or two that has that? That Gotenks has it. Physical Gotenks has it, yeah. There's a few Gotenkses that have it. Uh, like, again, these guys are solid. Um, but it's like they're... They could be really good if we had, like, a Goten and Trunks team that was, like, a legitimate team. The one thing that's a shame is that their ability can't be activated by Gotenks. If it could, I would see a much higher ceiling for these two. But it's just like, it's like, in theory, it's like, yeah, dude, like, you got the 80% damage reduction and you're good. But, like, you're not going to be able to have them together all the time. And it's like, if we would look at a lot of the, like, Kid Goten and Kid Trunks cards are, are just flat out not good at all. So, yeah, kind of, kind of a shame. But, you know, we'll see what happens. Maybe the physical Dokkan Fest gets a crazy easy A, um, and then they give us, like, another Trunks and Goten that maybe do... I, I mean, I guess, to be fair, we've never gotten a Trunks and Goten that fuse into Gotenks, huh? Like, like, the, like we have a million Goku and Vegeta, like, like, literally this right here, that then transform into this. The best we have is the LR Trunks and Goten... And it's part of their super attack. Um, this character right here. But the fusion is just part of their super attack. Not actually like a... Tra yeah, I guess the character is quite old. This one right here. But not actually like a transform into Gotenks type thing. That would be... I mean, we'll get that eventually. Like, if that's like the next Dokkan Fest, that then all of a sudden becomes interesting. Right? Like a Goten and Trunks Dokkan Fest that would transform into Gotenks. It would synergize well with all the Boo Saga stuff we get right now and LR Ultimate Gohan and stuff like that. So I certainly would not be opposed to that. Um, all right, let's just... Uh, I guess we'll just go ahead and sit this UI Goku down right here. Um, there's no way he lives this turn. Let's just throw this at him. Alright, 
All right, not bad. Let's go ahead and drop the second active, uh, and we'll just get Goten and Trunks up against UI Goku. Now, uh, UI Goku, Master UI Goku, he's going to be... Uh, we'll put mine in slot one, because the friend is definitely not going to have a dodge build, right? Yeah, no way. All right, we'll get mine in slot one, then. All right, let's do that. And bam. Okay. So, I guess we could put Trunks in slot one on this next rotation. I mean, he's going to be our best bet for slot one. Trunks is going to be guarding with damage reduction. Dodge this baby. Yep. Perfect. <laughs> We've already got a couple of those in the video so far. Again, you know, people, you know, they act like, oh, my builds are so bad. I see it everywhere. I mean, people say I'm tired of talking about it, but, you know, why do, you know, why do I see it that the builds are so bad, but then they work? Oh, my God. So crazy. Oh, please just do an additional super... Fuck! I hate additional characters, man. My God. Additional characters are the worst. Bruh. Fifty normals every time. Like I, people are dying to get characters. Like, yeah, please give me fifty more LR coolers where it's just normal, normal, normal. We love that, dude. My God. All right. Anyway. Oh, that's actually wow. Okay, that works really well for us. Now that we look at this. Um, I still. Okay, so we saw the good attack stat from Trunks. I know it's the Goten video, but remember, Trunks and Goten, I mean, they're virtually identical. How close are their stats? 16, 517, 11. Okay, so Trunks does have higher attack. So he's going to get better attack stats. Goten has got higher HP. Uh, Trunks and Go like they, they basically have the same uh, defense. It's very, very close. All right, we'll do this. We'll put Goten in slot one. Or slot two, excuse me. Um, I'm going to want to get, I think, one more rotation. Because we haven't seen Goten and Trunks in the video on the same rotation with one of them in slot three. So, I I'll probably just go into, like, one of the immortal bosses. Like, maybe, like, the Super Saiyan 3 Broly fight or something like that. And then we'll have, like, Trunks in slot two and then Goten in slot three. Oh, tr wow. We we dude, Trunks. We've gotten a couple of additionals from him in this video so far. That's good. That's good. That gives more damage to Goten. All right, UI Goku Super Attack. We'll live this easily. Or, or we or we dodge it. Yeah, we're guarding plus damage reduction. So he he would... Guarding plus 80% damage reduction. Uh, Trunks might have taken that for double digits, honestly. It would have been very, very low damage. And that's a, like, 2.2 million super attack, too. Double digits, yeah. Because, again, after supering on a rotation together, they have 80% damage reduction. Now, 80% damage reduction is very good. 50% ain't that good. 80% is definitely that good. Uh, all right. We probably lost. Probably. It was probably a GG. I just, no matter what, like, I'm just playing, getting the same type orbs and shit like that. And then before you know it, we're not able to transform into STR Super Vegito. Never, 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 dude. Don't super right away. Okay. We we got a little lucky, but, like, I don't know. I guess I could have put AGL Gohan as well. Hey, guys. Um, I don't know. Maybe this is crazy. Like, I'm going to say something super insane. What if you guys, like, gave us additional supers? Is that cool? Or just normals. Yeah, we just do normals. Yeah, just, just do 50 normals, dude. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Yeah, nice. Yeah, great. Super awesome. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks so much. I love additional base characters. No, I hate them. I actually do hate them. All right, so yeah, uh, we'll get that one more rotation where we just have, you know, Trunks in slot two and then Goten in slot three. I'll just go into, like, the Super Saiyan 3 Broly Dokkan event or, like, one of the Goku Black Dokkan events where the boss is immortal. And, um, you know, we can kind of see the damage that Goten or Trunks could do in slot 3. Because, again, remember, the stats that they're doing are different based upon every slot that they're in, right? Okay, sure. Where is the super attack at? Okay. Goku has a low cooldown. So he can super at any point. All right, uh, you, okay, here's the thing about dodge. You're not dodging everything. So eventually we're going to get hit. Uh, looks like it's not going to be today, though. Okay. Uh, we got to go Trunks since I won right here. For sure. Yep. Okay. Well, I mean, we saw them in the thick of it, right? Like, you know, they're in the middle of the action. All right, let's go. Let's see. How is he at? 35 right there? Okay. 
Remember, that's he has 50% damage reduction up at that moment. And then once he supers, he jumps up to the 80% damage reduction. If you, I, Goku would have supered him right there, again, it's... Oh, well, we saw it. This is very low. At like 50k damage or something? This is not going to hit very hard, is it? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Because UI Goku is like 2.2 million, 2.1 million. Like, that's around the damage that he's at. Remember, Trunks right there, 80% damage reduction plus guard. I mean, Goku is not hurting Trunks right there. I mean, that's good. I mean, that's a... a it is a 2 million plus super Trunks did tank. I mean, I know it's type, it, type advantage, but it's not like if it was type neutral, he would have got taken 700k. That wouldn't have happened. Um, all right, so let's just get that one more rotation I talked about, um, and then we'll finish up. All right, guys, here we go. Uh, we can go ahead and get this rotation right here. Let's just see the damage um, that Goten will do in the third slot. Remember that next to each other, they have all seven links, right? Both Goten and Trunks do have all seven up right here. Um, all right, so let's just see the damage we get. Um, again, I do want to give Trunks his own video. We'll, we'll kind of do a different team and then maybe fight the Evolution Blue Vegeta fight or something like that. You know, we'll, we'll kind of switch it up, but... Uh, I do want to make sure to give each character their own individual video. Uh, all right, so there's Trunks doing that. Remember, by Trunks supering first, he's also going to give Goten a little bit of extra support. 18 jumps up to That's pretty good for a sub EZA. And remember, in that third slot right there, 21 we get up to. Oh, boy. Uh, okay. I mean, that's... Sure, sure, sure. I mean, that's... For a sub EZA... I mean, understand, so he does a 21 million attack stat right there, after doing an 18 million attack stat, um, and he has 80% damage reduction, too. 80% damage reduction. And, remember, it's a, in slot 1, 20% chance to crit, slot 2, 30% chance to crit, slot 3, 50% chance to crit, and we did actually get the crit right there, too, so... All right, yeah, there's the Goten and Trunks. I mean, they, they seem solid. I mean, considering they're sub-EZAs, I will take it, man. Dokkan continuing the strong 2024 uh, releases. All right, guys, so there was the Goten and Trunks. Um, the EZA Goten and Trunks were obviously intended to be um, from the Bio Broly movie, right? Uh, so let's go ahead and swap over here. So this is Power in Full Force. Super Saiyan Goten Kid. Uh, leader skill is the Kamehameha category key 3. Um, and 120% of stats. Or int and physical types 3 key. And 90% of stats. Certainly you could use Goten and Trunks. Because Trunks has the same type of leader skill, right? Certainly you could use Goten and Trunks for like Battlefield. Right? Like I, I think, you know, potentially having a bunch of different Kamehameha leaders. Could be a good thing right there. Uh, Goten's passive, full of courage. Gets 180% attack and defense at the start of turn, then 50% damage reduction, uh, then 120% attack and another 30% damage reduction on super if there is a Kid Trunks or Krillin in the turn. Now, we saw at the start a very weak boss doing 300k plus to Trunks with just the 50% damage reduction. So, it's like, don't expect these characters to be tanky at all when it's just them by themselves, right? Like, it, it's if they super, like, either Goten or Trunks and the others on rotation, they'll be okay. But if they're by themselves, uh, it's like that 50% damage reduction will do nothing because their defense is pretty low, considering because it's just this, and then they're just getting the defense right there. That's it. But they're not getting, like, a passive super attack, right? Buff. Uh, so then, uh, as the first attacker in the turn... Uh, Goten gives Kamehameha category allies one key and 50% attack. Um, and then I believe Goten himself gets a 20% chance to crit. Uh, then Kamehameha category allies get two key, 70% attack. And then Goten himself gets a 30% chance to crit as the second attacker in the turn. And then as the third attacker in the turn, Goten gets 120% attack, a high chance to crit on super, and then three key. Again, as the third attacker in the turn. We saw Goten do some pretty big damage as the third attacker right there. Uh, his super attack is the Triple Kamehameha, uh, which greatly raises attack and defense for one turn, does supreme damage to the enemy, and then raises allies' attack by 40% for one turn. Um, so it's a, it's a very strong super attack effect. Remember, 
I, I think, like, expectations are important for characters, right? Like, I'm not looking for sub-EZAs to sit in slot one and laugh at Blue Gogeta. That's not the point. So, I, I mean, under that context, I think that this Goten and the Trunks are very good. It's just a matter of, can we get the characters that they need around them? Which is Kamehameha category characters, and, you know, the Goten Trunks. I mean, or Krillin. I, I mean, it's there are a lot of Krillin characters. Krillin has never gotten a Dokkan Fest. He could. Krillin has never gotten... Well, I guess he has gotten an LR, right? But uh, not a summonable LR. But Krillin easily get a Dokkan Fest. Like, and should and deserves a Dokkan Fest. Krillin deserves a Dokkan Fest more than, like, 15 Dokkan Fest we've had, right? So Krillin definitely should get one. Um, you know, if the next Dokkan Fest is, again, Goten and Trunks that fuse into Gotenks or a Krillin. Um, you know, this Goten and Trunks could be in business. Very easy. So there's that. Uh, Goten's link set is Golden Warrior, Super Saiyan, Kamehameha, Budding Warrior, The Innocents, Prepare for Battle, and Fierce Battle. So a nice solid link set right there. Uh, Tool Q Multiplier is 140%. Um, and again, the Goten and Trunks, they have just kind of like your traditional Super Saiyan link set. So many characters who are good or could be good with super easy A's or easy A's are in here, right? These two right there. I mean, they're both like, I mean, I don't know about Namek Goku. It feels like Namek Goku is probably going to easy it during a big sell. Like, I don't think it's going to be like, okay, it's October random Dokkan Fest time. And they're just like, oh, Namek Goku's easing. Like that feels like that's going to probably happen in a big celebration or something like that. I mean, I, yeah, because the 2020 Worldwide Download Celebration characters, for Global, they were kind of here in Golden Week, but for JP, they were anniversary easy A's, right? So, uh, maybe Namek Goku will, I mean, I, do we think Namek Goku could easy A as part of the 10th anniversary? I guess he could. Ah, uh, dude, okay, I'll be, imagine, bro, imagine that LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, the LR Gods, LR Namek Goku and LR Full Power Freeze are all easy in the same cell. Like, phew. man, that's the thing. Like now, like we're in the era of all these e characters that are going to easy a have incredible animations, are very fun characters, already have decent kits. Uh, you know, so like yeah, we're looking good. All right, so there's that. Uh, we looked pretty much at all. You know, his super attack effect. Um, you know, links all that good stuff. Let's go and take a look at Goten's categories here. Uh, so Goten, of course, is on the Hybrid Saiyan category team. Um, and Goten and Trunks, I mean, it's it just... Uh, you could run them. Uh, it's just that they're they're a little bit at big time at risk without the other one on rotation as well. Or another Kid Trunks or Goten. Again, we're looking for... I skipped by him. Uh, this character. Very easy. It could be very interesting. This guy's easy. It could be very interesting as well. All right, so there's them. Uh, then, of course, Goten and Trunks are also on the Boo Saga team. Uh, Goten is on Movie Hero as well. Remember, these are older characters. When Categories first came out, they put all these Boo Saga characters on Movie Hero and Boo Saga. So it's kind of just a little weird, but whatever. Because these are intended to be characters from the, from the Bio Broly movie. So realistically, they probably shouldn't be on the Boo Saga category is what it is. Um, then they're also on the Go or Goten is on the Goku family category team. Uh, then Goten is also on youth. Okay. Nice addition to the youth category for sure. Uh, Goten is also on the Super Saiyan category. That's the team we showcase Goten and Trunks on today with Super Saiyan. Uh, then Goten is on the sibling bond category team. Uh, Goten is also on Kamehameha. That's kind of like the main team for Goten and Trunks is Kamehameha, since they are giving that support, right? Uh, then, uh, Goten is also on the Gifted Warriors category team. Goten is also on the Bond of Friendship category team right here. Uh, then Goten is on the Bond of Parent and Child. Um, and then finally, Goten is here on the Earthbred Fighter category team. So, there we go. There is the EZA Goten. Pretty good. I can't hate. Um, I, don't get lulled to sleep that, oh my god, they're going to be so good defensively even without the other around, because that's not the case. Um, but, like, considering they're sub-EZA characters, they look pretty damn good to me.